And Tamil Nadu government has denied a BJP permission to conduct a Vetrivel Yatra. The government cited COVID-19 as the reason for its decision and the BJP was to conduct the Vetrivel Yatra celebrating Lord Muruga to consolidate Hindu votes ahead of the Tamil Nadu election next year. The Yatra was to begin on November 6th and end a month later. The Tamil Nadu government has told the Madras High Court it would not allow the BJP to conduct the Vetri Vel Yatra, which was held in the state between November 6 and December 6. The government cited COVID-19 as the reason for its decision. The state is expected to officially communicate its decision to the state BJP unit later in the day. It was assumed that the BGP was to conduct the Vetri Vel Yatra celebrating Lord Muruga to consolidate Hindu votes ahead of the Tamil Nadu elections next year. The Yatra was to begin from Tirutani on November 6 and end at Tiruchendra a month later. Modeled on Rath Yatras, the campaign was to cover the six major temples of Lord Muruga in the state. Taking a cue from controversy where a derogatory video on Kanda Shasti Kawasam, a devotional song on Lord Muruga was uploaded by YouTube channel. The BJP announced a month-long Vetrivel Yatra. Initially, the party had also planned to conduct public meetings in the above six places with the campaign kick starting in October. But with the police refusing permission for the public meetings, citing COVID-19 pandemic, BJP was forced to drop the plan. The High Court was hearing two petitions which sought a ban on the Yatra due to COVID-19. The petitioner said it would pose a threat to the public and create law and order problems. They also claimed the Yatra was scheduled to end on December 6th, the anniversary of the Babri Masjid demolition, only to create communal problems. Chief Justice Amreshwar Pratap Sahi and Justice Senthil Kumar Ram Murthy disposed the petitions and allowed the state BJP unit to challenge the government's order. In court, state BJP President L. Murugan argued that the central government guidelines no longer prohibit religious congregations and only insisted on ensuring social distancing. Several political parties are opposing the Yatra, alleging it's a strategy for riot politics. Now with the 2021 Tamil Nadu Assembly elections due in a couple of months, the BJP is desperate to change the current trend. Even when the majority of country has been swayed by Modi wave, Tamil Nadu has been standing strong with anti-Modi wave. On multiple occasions in the last couple of years, the state has made hash go back Modi trend on social media. This time around, the Saffron Party with many such new and popular faces is trying to break into the state. Bureau Report.